Hello friends, welcome to the learning curve. Now look at this exponential equation. x plus 2 whole square minus x cube is equal to 8. And we have to find the value of x. Let's see how do we proceed in this question. Just move x cube on the right hand side. So we have x plus 2 whole square is equal to x cube plus 8. Now subtract 16 on both sides. So you get the equation like this. Further, write 16 as a square of 2, as a square of 4. So you have 4 square and here you have x cube minus 8. Further, you can write it as x plus 2 whole square minus 4 square is equals to x cube minus 2 cube. Here we can apply two algebraic identities. That is a square minus b square is equals to a plus b into a minus b. And for the cube, a cube minus b cube is equals to a minus b into a square plus a b plus b square. Right. Now expand it. Apply this formula uh, on this uh, on the value of left hand side. We have x plus 2 plus 4 bracket x plus 2 minus 4 is equals to and here you have x minus 2 bracket x square plus 2x plus 4. Okay. Now simplify this. You get x plus 6 and here you get x minus 2 is equals to x minus 2 bracket x square plus 2x plus 4. Now just change their position bringing this value on the right hand side. So you get x minus 2 bracket x square plus 2x plus 4 and taking this on the left hand side. Now move this content here x is minus 2 this is x square plus 2x plus 4 minus x plus 6 bracket x minus 2 is equal to 0. Now taking it out x minus 2 common, so you are left with x square plus 2x plus 4 minus x plus 6 whole bracket. Further x minus 2 into x square plus 2x plus 4 minus x minus 6 is equal to 0. Or you have x minus 2 into x square. This is the term of x and this is the term of x. So you have plus x. 4 is a constant and 6 is a constant. Minus 2 is equal to 0. Now this is x minus 2 and this is x square plus x minus 2. This is a quadratic equation. So you can factorize it by breaking the middle term. So you have 2x minus x into minus 2 is equal to 0. Further, x minus 2 out of these two terms, take out x common, x plus 2 minus taking out 1 common, x plus 2. Then x minus 2 in these two terms, x plus 2 is common and here you are left with x minus 1 is equal to 0. So we have three possibilities. That is x minus 2 is equal to 0, x plus 2 is equal to 0 and x minus 1 is equal to 0. So x is equal to 2. This is the first solution. And here x is equal to minus 2. This is the second, second solution. And here x is equal to 1. And this is the third solution. Since this is a third degree equation, so we have three solutions of x. I hope you understand it and if you like it, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.